YouTube and how are you guys doing today? I'm doing good and um, I'm going to be showing you guys how to get Ray's Minimap mod for Mac on uh, 1.5. If you watch my Let's Play series, you'd know I use that mod quite a bit. I used it in every episode. So, um, I'm going to download the one off of Minecraft Forum, which um, I'll have the link for this in the description. Um, scroll down and it's gonna have the downloads as you see you want to get the one for your latest version of Minecraft Which should be 1.5 so download that Should bring you to add fly Just um Just wait your five seconds. I know you guys can do it and then skip the ad come on I'm using chrome so it adds it right here. We are gonna wait for it. To... All right, just put that on your desktop now it's should look like this little zipper and it should say dot zip on the end double click it and it should make a folder right all right so now go to your minecraft folder if you are on um windows do percent app data percent and go roaming and if you're on mac click go in the top left hand corner of your screen and hold alt which is two buttons to the left of your space bar and a little library tab should come up click that and go to application support um minecraft then you should have your bin. Um, then you might not have all this stuff. It's because I, I've had many mods. But go into your bin. And if your Minecraft.jar looks like a folder right now, um, that's because you already have a mod installed. Or um, you've made it that way. So if I were you, I would just delete it right now and force update. Because this mod is not compatible with all mods. So you want to rename your Minecraft.jar to Minecraft.jar dot whoops dot zip like that and use dot zip if your computer doesn't do that then needs to go to the doctor and get a check double click that and it should make a folder that says minecraft dot jar we no longer need this dot zip because all it does is it just makes duplicates of the folder now go into your folder and you should have all this crap and you're like damn what do i do with all of it just scroll down and find meta inf which is in the m's M section. Went a little far there. Yes. Alright, meta inf. It, there's like three things in it. Just delete the folder. You need to do this for all mods. Alright. Now open your raised minimap folder, which you downloaded. Um, and then just drag everything in the folder, which there's three things, and just put it in your Minecraft.jar and replace. Once you do that, um, you're finished. Easy, man. That's how easy it is to uh, get this mod. So we no longer need this, these, because we already got it installed. Oh, you guys, you guys are in for a surprise, man. Been doing some work on my Let's Play series world. Create. I just want to show you that I have my my mini map, and I don't want to show my let's play world you're gonna have to wait for tomorrow guys so that's when it's gonna be uploaded so yep as you see you have the mini map in the top right hand corner of your screen there's a few things let me just put this into full screen so there's a few things you can do if you click x you'll zoom in like this um to make a waypoint click c hello puts it on here go to your waypoints but m is the menu you do waypoints you can turn it off and remove it so there's a lot of stuff cool stuff you guys can do with it and play around and figure it out so i hope this video got this video has helped you guys out um if so just uh, you know leave me a little like in the like section below maybe a comment on saying nice vid and if you really were happy man subscribe all right guys thank you for watching and see you next time goodbye